So we had the opportunity to practice with the drone. We just had a snowfall. Indiana doesn't have a lot of snow, as you can see from this video. And I am by no means an expert drone flyer. So I'm new to flying drones. And I use three batteries to get this amount of footage. Now, this is a view from the bottom with the gimbal up on it. As you can see, it makes it look a lot steeper than it really is. And we're going to turn around and show you the other perspective. This is from the top looking down. Like I said, it looks a lot more impressive from the bottom looking up. Now, I played with the light settings a bit and tried to coordinate with the, the sensors. It's a little too dark, but, and I also over rotate the drone a bit. Yeah, I was planning on videoing these two over here instead. No, not. Anyhow, uh, it was interesting flying in the cold weather because compared to when it was warmer, the drone is a lot less responsive. And I was having issues keeping it in the air. Um, it actually went down twice. But here, uh, <laughs> the kids always like to play in the mud. And here he hits some mud. Can't tell them anything at that age. So let's look. Make sure mom's not around. Nope. Don't see her. All right. Wipe the pants off. Otherwise, I'm in trouble. And here we attempt it again. And I was amazed at how hard it is to try and follow and keep it all in sight. Finally, I got my son to move and not start in the mud and actually start in a little bit of the snow that we have. So, as you can see, I'm still jerky on the, on the gimbal and on the sticks. Um, trying to practice even through the day, I got better as the day went on, but it, it's going to take some practice. Those that are very smooth, you know, it's, it, you know, I have a new appreciation for their skills. Now here they're trying to fly together, but all of a sudden right here, I lose control of the drone. And the drone crashes. Not sure why I was even trying to push up on both. So we're going to take a little break and show you a little bit of footage of me uh, flying over the frozen pond while I walked down this hill to get the drone. Not really what I wanted to do on this day, but like I said, the drone crashed twice. The other one was right here on the frozen pond, luckily, just flying along like this. And I actually cut this part of it out because it was when I was flying back. It's flying flat and even, and all of a sudden, for no reason, it just dropped. Both times, the batteries were over 50%. I don't know if the drone just got so cold or what all transpired, but it just went down. Well, here's some more footage of us riding on the on the hill. And when they do hit snow, they can get some good speed. And a couple times the kids did go all the way down to those hay bales. Now I'm just practicing some skills, which I don't have. And Believe it or not, I had this on the cinema setting. But anyhow, that was it for today. Appreciate you watching. Don't forget to subscribe, like, and make any comments. I'm here to learn. Thanks for watching.